Check out the fog. Had a great call with my bookkeeper, so just working out some things. I'm probably better off buying a new car, so you just never know. And this is why you have people on your team that are experts and know what they're doing so that they can help you in these times. Um, bookkeepers, accountants, um, PAs, people experts in their field so that you can get the information that you need. To do the things you want to do. I definitely don't do it all myself because I don't know everything. Um, but grateful that I have those people on my team. So just got home and now I can get some work done. I have spent the past three hours on calls. <laughs> so productive, bookkeeping, um, a friend, and then another friend as well organizing next week's uh, plan. But not much to really film, but that's why I'm going to share with you this. Today was filled with a lot of, I guess, the mundane, usual stuff, but back-to-back -back calls, masterclass tonight, and one of the themes that was coming up, and even with today, in my life, in, in everything that I was doing was keep it simple. Keep whatever you are trying to do as simple as you can because it's going to take the pressure off. If you keep it simple and you go, okay, what do I want? And what's the next step to get there? You can start taking those little steps. You can then start to do those things which are gonna compound over a long period of time to then get you to where you wanna be. And if you think about it, if you're trying to get fit, what's a simple step you can take? Not go from zero to a hundred. Because if you go from zero trying to run a marathon, you're going to hurt yourself. It's not going to happen. You need to progress. Because it's the same when it comes to business. It's not you know, making the million dollars tomorrow or creating the successful event tomorrow. It's what's the simple step you can take, that first step you can take to then build momentum and get you on that journey to get to wherever you want to get to. Um, it could be, you know, if you're in the market for a new car, what's the simple first step to take? Well, go have a look at cars, go test drive cars and see what you like. If it's, you know, you want to be more mindful and have a better mindset or, um, you know, ease your thoughts and stress and anxiety, maybe the simple thing is to meditate or learn how to meditate. Try meditation if your body's feeling uh, stiff and sore. Do yoga. Simple first steps. Uh, if you want to get healthier, simple first steps. Start eating healthier. Drinking more water. Like, I think we complicate things so much. And even myself at times. Um, find myself getting caught up in the detail, in analysis, in so many things when it's like just keep it simple and you know you make progress. You then assess after you know a week, two weeks, you trial things. But take those simple steps. Make it simple for yourself. And when you do that, it doesn't get overwhelming, it doesn't get overbearing. Okay, I want this, what's a step? So they're going, what's all the steps? You don't have to have it all figured out. I think taking that first step and keeping it simple allows you to think and allows you to actually be present in whatever it is you want to do.